You want a bottle of water, Dad, or you don't need a bottle of water? You no, know, I got a bottle of water. I wanted to get a, a tissue because oh, I spilled okay. my bottle of water. Oh, oh there. Or you can give me a... Hey, yeah. David, you're on the internet. Oh, hello. Welcome to Family RPG. I'm David Linder, the Game Master for Acquisition oh, Incorporated. Thank you. thank you. Part 12. And you notice a little name under there. It's uh, Lottie's Palace. Uh-oh. Mm -hmm. So, recap for a point of inspiration. What happened last time? We had the massive air bo battle on the battle balloons. Mm -hmm. We oh, yeah. went so yeah. far yeah. off the rails you had to improvise, but that's not really being specific. Um, we wrecked two ships out of the air, kept ours. All three somewhere. were wrecked, essentially. Yeah. But, yeah. S tried to sell two off through the corporation. Yeah. And uh, we had a battle on the, between the two. Uh, enemy ships. We were on yep. one enemy ship, and uh, the other enemy ship that supposedly didn't have any any uh, uh, weapons on it, except for what the people had who went there. Anyway, uh, very interesting. I had one on one combat with a, a wow. hobgoblin captain, mm -hmm. and her. Um, or was it a Drake? What was she riding on? Griffin. Huh? Griffin, okay. Yes. Mm. You're not going to be too powerful. Yeah, Griffin, okay. It was something that was flying, okay. Yep. Many yeah. goblins were slain. Mm -hmm. Indeed, indeed. <coughs> you kind of liked how I had the one boss battle, whereas you guys had, with all the minions. Dealt with the mobs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like, okay, I'm alone. Let's do this. I managed not to teleport up to three miles away from where we were. And then we landed in. Oh, what happened it's... before that? There's something in between. Hmm. Before well, that? Let's yeah. see what we got on Are this Are you talking... Ship? What was the last thing you fought? Well, I was going to say the last thing we fought was a bunch of... Uh, Almost zombified new mutants out of. Before that. Before that. Hmm. On the ship. We fought all the um, methods. There you go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then we uh, uh, landed in Fortune mm -hmm. and fought all those uh, new mutants and they want tokens. Yes. Tokens, token, tokens, tokens. Token. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Durgar. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. right. Durgar, yes. yes. I just kept picturing mm -hmm. his new mutants in my head. Fair, <laughs> fair enough. Mm. The trailer just came out for that uh, today. Apparently, Disney is still releasing the new mutants film, despite Fox basically wanting to cancel it. It was hmm. not well received. <laughs> but Disney paid for it, and it's like, well, it'll make something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Every comic book movie makes something. Okay. Yes, the Dorogo models with the hill giants. Yeah. Or rock giants or whatever those were. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. point to Matt. Yay. You did the most, yes. I burned up all my... Mm -hmm. <laughs> we tend to. Mm -hmm. Sometimes on silly things, too. Oh, where did you find the water? Uh, there was poisonous water, mm -hmm. and... Uh, um, the, the uh, uh, guys that we killed ended up having uh, their own version of it that was alcoholic. Yes. Mm -hmm. The mm. two-headed poison water. Oh, yes, yes. There's a 50% chance it'll give you two heads. Yeah. <coughs> the power of poison. To which we stole some. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Very steals. I mean, we just took it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Anyways... Uh, so you leave Fortune because nothing really fortune, you know, the, the real fortune. It was unfortunate. It was unfortunate. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, and also, uh, we are still using our advent calendar of uh, criticals, whether it's critical hit or critical miss. And we are so far, I think, on day thirteen's last one we did. Yeah. So day will be day fourteen. Oh, over halfway done. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so you're going to make a copy of that print that we could hang up or? I still oh, got some get time. Print. Print. Oh. What? Who's oh, that? It, it's the the speaker that I had playing music, and if it doesn't play anything, it just turns itself off. Oh, oh. okay, that's nice of it. And it tells you it's turning itself off. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Loudly. Mm-hmm. Yes. So, so, anyways. Yeah. 
When next we meet our adventurers... The cavern looms more than 20 feet wide and tall, opening up to a dark tunnel that winds its way beneath the foothills. A strange smell hangs on the air, reminiscent of oil and ozone. Sorry, guys. Uh. If you want to make an investigation or perception check. Okay. Oh, I like perception. <clears throat> oh, perception doesn't have a badge. Uh, nine. Okay. <laughs> what do you mean? That was with the advantage. <laughs> Sai, you find a pressure <coughs> plate running wall to wall under the dirt floor. You also know that a rectangular object hanging from the ceiling 50 feet farther down the tunnel. Hmm. Guys, you don't want to stand on this. <laughs> okay. Okay. Can we walk around the pressure yes. plate? Yes. Okay. <sighs> <laughs> don't do that. A sense of air pressure even? Like wind uh, would blow it? Uh, I don't know. Why chance it? Mm -hmm. Okay. So do you have dark vision? Yes. I do. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Conveniently, you notice in the dark in your dark vision. We have two elves um, and a, or half orcs. So. Yeah. Yes. Uh, so you notice a metal sign that was connected to this that says, "Welcome, you are almost here." <laughs> You're almost here. Like if you had stepped on this, it would have been like lights and noises and "Welcome, you are almost here." Ah. Uh, uh, this is so an alarm hanging down. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Make another perception check. Ooh. Well. Natural 20. Okay. Four. All right. This time you find it. Hey, have my candy first. Same uh, kind of pressure plate. Pressure plate. Police to another sign that spells out tokens available. The tokens available, guys. Tokens. Oh, Yes, so I haven't heard. We were told. Uh, another perception check. Oh, boy. Give me my candy. Natural 20. <laughs> <laughs> 17. Okay. I got 17. I got 16. That's 14. Okay. No, 15. It's actually a little easier to see this because there's a bridge leading over a glowing green river. Beyond this bridge, uh, you see a sign that reads, ah, Lucis Slots in Theorem. What? Lucis Slot? Lucis Slots in Theorem. Somebody translate that for me? Mm -hmm. The darkness of the tunnel suddenly gives way to the light. Tiny, don't worry about okay. it. <laughs> glowing globes, many of them blinking, flare to life along the walls and the ceiling ahead. Mm. Hanging from the tunnel roof is an enormous sign around which more globes of light chase each other and on which are lit up the words Lottie's Palace. Wide steps at the end of the tunnel lead up to a set of open double doors. Mm. Double said, doors. I'm so glad you don't pronounce it like yeah. I always did. The yes, double yes. doors are open. So we just go up to the double board? Uh, they are not open right oh, now. Oh, they're not. You can't not open them. I thought you said that. Oh, they are open. Sorry. Open set. That's what I, I, I heard. They're they're open set. Open. Eh? My bad. <laughs> they are open. Okay. So you go in? Uh, we look in first. What do we see? Right. <clears throat> if you look through the doors, you enter a world of opulence. We don't enter it yet. Again? We observe it. We look through it. Well, anyway, okay. Okay. <laughs> Glass chandeliers fill a huge open chamber with brilliant light. The floors are carpeted. The walls decorated with scroll work and painted with images of golden coins bearing the letter L. Dark mm. wooden beams span the vast ceiling, mm. and which glitters with a thousand tiny gems. Fast. The center of the area holds a sunken <clears throat> gambling pit that is packed with people sitting in leather upholstered chairs around tables covered in green velvet. Mm. To one side of the hall is a stage velvet. where three harpists <laughs> play, surrounded by a lounge with comfortable chairs and small tables. Oh, Beyond that is the bar, and a door presumably leading to a kitchen. <coughs> a sign to your right indicates the powder room, where another to your left indicates tokens. To the far left is a fortified iron door sealed with a large lock. The center of the far wall features another set of double doors. The clientele here all look a lot like the Duragar you saw in the Town of Fortune. All are gambling in a frenzy, arguing with one another over tokens, and swearing the next game will be the big one. Most of them are drinking heavily. As you take it all in, a skeleton wearing a red uniform with a high collar and a crisp looking hat approaches you. A skeleton? Hello? Yes. Uh, is there a cover charge, or okay. is there like a minimum drink? You should get some tokens at the cashier. What's up with these tokens? Everybody's talking about tokens. He's also holding a, a tray of drinks. Would you like some beverages? I'm good. Um, probably okay. not. Yeah. Can you <laughs> drink one? Sure. Okay. It's a mixture of rum and fruit juice. Oh, mm. rum's disgusting. <laughs> ah, well, fruit juice probably helps. Anyway, okay. Make a nature check. Ah. Uh. <laughs> 
Evan? Mm. Eh. They do taste delicious, but you think if you drank too many of them, you <clears throat> might get poisoned. Mm. Well, typical rum. Mm-hmm. Mm. Typical skeleton. You see a total of uh, 20 skeletons working the floor acting as dealers, bartenders, waitstaff, and entertainment. Many are dwarf-sized, possibly former Duragar. Hmm. If you want to make a perception check. Sure. 30-20. Okay. Mm. You notice that there's a small clockwork device 15, 15. attached to the inside of each skeleton's skull that lights up when it speaks. <laughs> Okay. So they don't really speak on their own. They have a bunch of pre-recorded messages. Aha. Uh -huh. Interesting. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to use it very often. I'm going to use my divine sense. Mm-hmm. Are they actually undead? Yeah. Okay. Mm. I'm very comfortable, guys. <laughs> you uncomfortable? Yes. There's a whole lot of undead here. Mm-hmm. But none of them seem to be fighting. They all <coughs> seem to be playing games and laughing and... Hmm. Well, we should get some tokens. Mm hmm We inspect it. Uh, how much do tokens cost? So you go up to the token counter? Token counter, yeah. Token you counter. see a, a, a skeleton woman. As much as you can tell. Yeah. <laughs> She's wearing a wig. No, uh, well, she has a, a red dress. Okay. A long red okay. dress on. She uh, points to the sign that says, uh, tokens, uh, one token is five gold. Five gold? Woo! I'll, I'll take one token. Okay. Okay. So I've got. Most games cost at least three tokens, though, so. Oh. No, one token. That's <laughs> so uh, somebody asked for my token. I got one. So I observe. Look at the token. Is there anything special about the token? Does it look like it's. Uh, will they take the platinum rods? Um, they will take things that have equivalent gold value. I have four platinum rods at 15 gold each. Okay. So 60 there, and I'll put 100 I got. How many tokens are you buying? <laughs> Enough. Enough. <laughs> oh. Can I you can also buy tokens? super lucky tokens for the low, low cost of 10 gold each. You can buy Super them. lucky tokens. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> These look identical to the ones your Durgar, your, your Drap, not Durgar. Yeah, of course. Your, um, your, no. The... Yeah. The dwarf guys found in the in the vault. Ah, yeah. Okay. The ones that look more like gold, and these look more like just copper. Huh. But the at least the super lucky tokens are gold plated. All right, I will do ten One super lucky. So, mm -hmm. at, <coughs> so that's a hundred. Yes. And then twelve regular for sixty. Correct. Mm hmm. All right. You can't tell the difference. They look a little different. The L-stamped tokens are made of copper covered with a thin layer of gold, the same as ones you saw in the Horn Enclave. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll Did abstain. we pick any of those up or not? You, you couldn't could. because you were in dwarves. Okay. Yeah. That's right. That's yes. Right. Yeah. yeah, we were in the dwarves. Yeah. Yes. We were in dwarves. You see here, take your, uh, your uh, uh, platinum rods to a uh, huge chest in the far side of the room, and it just seems to teleport out of the building. Okay. Oh. Yeah. So no stealing from them. <coughs> hmm. But an interesting getaway. <laughs> How big is The chest isn't big enough for someone to fit in. Uh, <sighs> You're not even a half room. No, it's yeah. small enough for that. Dang. Mm -hmm. Hmm. And it has to completely close in order for you see a flash of light and some uh, teleport. So you can't just stand on top of it. It has to... Yes. Yeah. Okay. So you see a lot of different games, including Three Dragon Ante, Dice, Dragon Chess, uh, Roulette, Blackjack, and a cutthroat role-playing game called Papers and Paychecks. <laughs> Papers and Paychecks? Mm-hmm. Hmm. E each game costs uh, three tokens. Okay. It's also a set of slot machines. And <clears throat> Let's just go up to a slot machine. Nice and easy. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, three tokens to yeah. try also a slot machine. Three lucky tokens, too. Huh? We're going to just go with three regular to see how three it regular. works. Uh, uh, roll percentile. Interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, 29. Mm. 
Bust. Okay. Use your dicks. Well, I'm sitting in a slot machine. Let's go one more time. <laughs> the uh, liner bandit. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. It's a bandit eye. It's this series of clockwork mechanisms and a red lever. And 28. <laughs> Bust. <laughs> 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 And what exactly do my super lucky tokens do? <laughs> You're spending three of those? Uh, why not? You go to a different machine? You're changing the dice. No, just, yeah. <laughs> what do my super luckies give me? Roll again? Yeah. 28. You get one token back. Wow. One super lucky or one regular? One regular. <laughs> one regular. Aha. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh, seems like the threshold yeah. for the super luggies is 28. Yeah. Okay, is it all games? Is this the same mechanic? Um, there's different checks for obviously the, it, the slot machine is entirely percentile, whereas the other ones actually involve history, perception, investigation, deception, you know, depending on what game you're playing. Oh. So you just blew nine tokens? What about you said history? But we gained one. Well, history is yeah. basically to, to figure out the game's rules or analyze the opposition. Okay. While investigation well, or deception right. could be careful play or cagey bluffing. So okay. He wants to pick a game, but he has to know the history. I'll give it a chance. Even if you play the papers and paychecks, it's just the same kind of rules. So. All right. We're going to go three super lucky. Okay. For which game? We'll do papers and paychecks. Okay, so make a history check. 19. Okay, you're able to figure out how the game works. And make a perception check. 19. Okay, you're seeing what everyone else is doing within the game. Mm -hmm. Um, Make an investigation check. We're hitting most of my good ones here. Mm. 15. Still good. You managed to win three tokens. Super luckies? Yes. So I Uh won the same amount back? Yes. Wow. Oh, plus two regular tokens. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I feel like we should walk around. You also hear from, as you were playing, um, one of the (coughs) inebriated gamblers says uh, Lotti's Palace has been in operation for over 10 years. Hmm. Before a casino was built, the cavern that was carved out of was home to Clan of Dorgar. Mm-hmm. When Lotti arrived, she offered Dorgar jobs, building her mare, lair and mining tokens. When the casino was complete, Lotti fired his work, her workforce, mm-hmm. but offered each of them a starter set of tokens a severance package. <laughs> we took up gambling and drinking. <laughs> Yeah, well, what do you do to earn more tokens? Yeah, obviously, the, the games are stacked against you. You're going to run out of tokens. The house always wins. <laughs> Lottie employs only skeletons to work at her palace. Many of which were once door mm. That's basically the conversation you've heard so far. If you try another game, you might have some different people. Trying another game. Okay. Mm. History check. <coughs> Doing super luckies. Mm-hmm. Why not? Hmm. History check is a nine. Mm. <coughs> Twenty-one. Okay. Roll a perception check. Six. Okay. Roll an investigation check. <laughs> Seventeen. Okay. Okay. Uh, roll a deception check. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Natural 20! Mm. 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 16. Up the corner. Mm. A few balls. Mm. Mm. Oh, you get run over by a ball. Okay. You get one regular token. Okay. Mm-hmm. You didn't quite succeed. You didn't quite fail. 
I don't think we can win. <laughs> you should, should have, well, of course you can. It's gambling. Uh, you, you should have an odd number of uh, lucky tokens, extra lucky. I have four left. Four left. Yeah. Uh -huh. Some of Duergar started to, decided to start up a new town next to Casino to sell tokens at lower cost. They took on construction loans and named their town Fortune. After a lot of hard work, consumers of the casino began to come to Fortune to get tokens. Lottie lowered her prices in response. Fortune quickly became unable to pay its debts and town was abandoned. <laughs> How could they afford to sell tokens at a lower cost? They have to pay the casino the going rate for the tokens. Yeah. That makes no sense. Yeah. It's, mm. yeah. I'm assuming counterfeit tokens or... Huh. Huh. Lottie loves clockwork. She has crafted many amazing machines, including the clockwork machine room that powers a casino. Hmm. Hmm. Is Lottie a wizard? That's a... <laughs> Let's play another game and find out. Uh -huh. Ooh. We'll go. Regular. Okay. I'm glad you had the finances to do all this. <laughs> <laughs> History? Uh, yes. Uh, 14. Okay, good. Perception? 7. Mm. Investigation? 7. <laughs> Deception? Mm. 16. Mm. You just lose all your tokens. Okay. Mm -hmm. well, what what would have other had, if he got lower? Would he like had to get more yes. tokens? Yes. <laughs> wow. Yes. Some harsh games. Yes. Hmm. You find out the uh, machine room behind fortified metal door controls all clockwork devices in casino, including locked double doors that lead to Lottie's room. Mm -hmm. Lottie is not only a powerful wizard, she's a lich. Mm -hmm. Okay. Time to play more games? Mm -hmm. Well, that's all the information you're going to get. All right, well, we're going to try one more game just, get, just, just for kicks. Just super yeah. lucky. Well, I mean, you can't really spend these tokens anywhere else, so... Yeah. Huh. Use them up or gain as many as you can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can exchange them back for the gold. You paid for them, mm -hmm. the likelihood of you actually making more than what you put into it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Three super luckies. Mm -hmm. Which I'm starting to feel have no benefit. But they don't. History they don't. first. Mm -hmm. Fifteen. Good. Perception. Thirteen. Good. Investigation. Eleven. Mm. Deception. Ooh. No. <laughs> Three. You lose all your tokens and you owe one more token. One more standard or a special? One standard token, okay. yes. Right, I'll get back to that. <laughs> oh, man, did you want to try some? I only got one token. I can't play anything. Okay. <laughs> hey, can I borrow a token? Sure. <laughs> one token. One token. <laughs> <coughs> Squared up. Yes. Oh, you oh, you didn't have any tokens left? No, I owed one oh. more token. Okay, fine. Okay, you're good. <laughs> All right, we won't make sure our debts are paid here. Uh -huh. We don't know what these people will do. Right. Mm -hmm. So you see, the club lounge is clearly the place to hang out. A sign on the wall says so. Huge fish tanks feature brightly colored fish and an octopus. Soft leather chairs provide a great place to sober up or to enjoy a delicious drink at the bar. You see a skeleton bartender <laughs> using. Do I see anybody sobering up? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh no. No. Of course not. Yeah. Skeleton bartenders using clockwork devices to shake rum drinks, peel fruit, blend fruit and juices, create souvenir flattened tokens at the cost of three tokens. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Door okay. behind the bar leads to the kitchen. Do I get any comp drinks for? Uh, are are the Game drinks comp? Being a high roller. Um, I think the drinks are complimentary. The first drinks that the initial bartender offered oh, you were complimentary. Yes. Uh, yeah. ah. You want to make a perception check of the bartender? Natural 20. Okay. Give me some more chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> he wears a brass key around his neck. Uh -huh. It appears to go to hmm. the, uh, to the uh, machine room. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. You should get the key. <laughs> I 
my eyes you get the key? Yes. Oh. You're the most nimble fingers the route was. I see. As you, as you approach, you see this bartender just mm -hmm. mixing various drinks. What'll it be? How much is a drink? First one's free. First one's free. Um, what type of drinks do you have? You said, what'll it be? Uh, they have rum drinks, fruit juices. Or uh, a random drink? Or a random drink. They also have delicious meals available for three tokens. <laughs> they don't specify what they are, it's just delicious meals. Everything's three tokens. Fifteen gold for a meal. Very <laughs> exquisite meal, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's probably. I'll take a fruit the... drink, I guess. This, okay. This is the first one's free. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. It looks like a really nice, like, okay. nice, uh, and fancy I, drink. And I sip it. Mm hmm. It tastes good? Yeah, it tastes good. Okay. Mm hmm. You also believe that if you were to have been drinking while playing those games, the checks would have been increasingly difficult. Ah, uh, makes sense. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'll have a, a virgin drink, please. That's a fruit juice. Yeah. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> yeah, you, you can mix in yeah. just, just just juice. Yeah. Okay, sure. Okay. Juice. Yeah. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm parched. Mm. Okay. You don't yeah. look parched. I pull out some parchment. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So. Okay, I don't have parchment, I lied. Yes. I get a fruit drink. <clears throat> yes, you did. What fruit drink is it? Mango. Mango. Oh. Okay. <laughs> hmm. I guess I'll drink it. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <coughs> so what are you planning on doing to get this key? Um... Hmm, does he look like he's uh, able to be distracted? Um, One of my uh, fellows could distract him. Is, it, is the key, uh, what, what type of chain is the key on? Is it something that has a link that can be removed or? It's just on, on, a, on a necklace. A necklace. Mm -hmm. a necklace. That You're not really sure if his eye sockets are necessarily his eyes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Maybe try handing him back the drink, but then like putting it in front of his face and pull, try to pull the key. Oh, well, I'll give it a shot. Make what a sleight of hand check. Sleight of hand. Oh. Three. Four. <laughs> Four. He immediately pushes your hand, hands oh. down. Okay. And it's like, please leave the drinks on the bar. Oh, okay. Um. I failed. Hmm. Mm. He kind of shifts his head slightly sideways. Yeah. You want in the back? Well, yeah. We have some business with um, the owner. Six tokens. Six tokens. <laughs> we want to buy six tokens? That's going to have to come out of group funds. Party funds, yeah. Group there. funds, okay. Yeah. All right, so we go over and buy six tokens. And there are five each? Yes. Okay. All right. And we hand them six tokens. Okay. <coughs> Staring to Kogan's course. Oh, of course. He looks around side to side, kind of ushers you into the back. Mm-hmm. Uh, strange clockwork devices prepare food here, all of them slicing, dicing, stirring, mixing, and cleaning in a frenzy. Uh, make perception checks. Mm. 30, 20. Okay. Mm. okay. 12. And, um, 30, 20. Okay. Both Psy and I'm Luce... I'm a gives me advantage on this. I still can't <laughs> roll well. Yeah. Both Psy and Luce notice that the, um, the food itself looks particularly unhealthy. Questionable meats, past their prime vegetables, copious amounts of lard. <laughs> Skeletons come and go to pick up food and drop off dishes. Hmm. Does that even look like if it's humanoid meat? Hmm. No. Okay. Try to identify what the creature might have been. Probably pig. Okay. Mm. Cow. 
they're just like not not really freshly prepared. Just it's been there for mm -hmm. a while. Because yeah. they're skeletons, they don't necessarily know <laughs> or help. care. Yeah, yeah, or care. Yeah. Got to sell it today and eat. Yeah. Huh. Well, or should have sold okay. yesterday. Should have sold yesterday, right? Uh, okay. So we need to find a wizard. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, keep so there are uh, two sets of doors: one to the north and one to the west. Hmm. North by northwest. Uh -huh. Do you want to go north first? Wait, is the guy still with us, or did he just let us in? He just let you in. Oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. <coughs> mm. Mm. Which way do you want to go? Are you rolling a dice for that? <laughs> mm. I do have the locate object spell. It works within a thousand feet of me. Do you have to know the object? Describe or name an object that is familiar to you. You sent this direction. Well, we we're looking for the. Uh, um, what were those things? Okay, <laughs> a specific object known to you at the as Wheel as of Stars. As long as you have seen it up close, we have thirty feet at least once. We have, we have not. Seen not no. 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 <laughs> Alternatively, this spell can locate the nearest object of a particular kind, such as a certain kind of apparel, jewelry, furniture, tool, or weapon. We don't even know what the Wheel of Stars is. It lasts for ten minutes. Could you locate <coughs> Lottie's signature? We've seen that. A what? Lottie's signature. Oh. That's sort of everywhere though, right? Oh, his written signature? Yeah. Her. Oh, her. Lottie was a female? Her. Yeah. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Had I seen that? We had that letter while we were down in the... Um, he didn't see it. He was uh, at the... He was at the wedding. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I backed out of the vow. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> yeah he sent us home before he even had a clue that we were mm -hmm. actually <laughs> we found out enough information. Yes. It worked out in the long run. It did, yes, yes. Comedic timing. Uh huh. <laughs> so, well. so that's what you call it, huh? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know offhand. Mm. Mm -hmm. So, which door? North. North. You're opening it. I open north. <laughs> it's locked. <laughs> I yes. don't open north. <laughs> I go for west. It's locked as well. Well, then. Uh oh. Yeah. Does anybody help? I don't think I have any. Proficiency in, in thieves' tools? Not anymore. Mm -mm. I had a list of supplies here. I'm pretty sure they were the ones that I had taken with me then. Uh, yeah, I do have thieves' tools, so this list is things I have on me. Yes? So, yes. Uh, I can try them. Sure, here. Okay, which door are you going to try? I tried north first. North it is. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. Check. Straight decks. No bonus. Mm. Anybody watching that? Aside from no. you and me? I don't 22. see you. Okay. I don't even see you. Easily open it. You, how would you show up? <laughs> huh? It's open. open. Cool. Yes. Yeah. The floor of this room is covered in red tiles no. surrounding a large swimming pool. The bottom of which glitters with a thousands of gems. Oh, it shows here that we are oh, Around the room, spray water oh. into the air that hangs as a fine mist. <laughs> oh, we made it? We yep. made it to a large swimming pool. Oh. How about I hold on to the thieves' tools? <laughs> sure. Mm -hmm. So you're going to write that down then? Yes. I'll cross it off. Okay. Make a perception check. Natural 20. Can I have candy for not a good reason? Oh. <laughs> it even's hanging on its top. Oh, wow. But <laughs> mm. oh, you got a one? You got a yeah. one. That's mm. why not a good reason. Let's see. Yeah. 
18. I got 16, uh, 15. Mm -hmm. There's another bear. Yay! <laughs> and then I get 19. These are very good. Uh -huh. So most of you notice that there are a mm, copious <laughs> amount of tokens in the fountain. Uh -huh. uh, you know, stop cooking behind us. Man, <laughs> analyze the water. Just to see if the water is safe. Mm. I'm not sure how we'll do that. Interesting choice. Um, let's put uh, put a piece of metal in the water. Just metal? Well, oh, what's a good thing to, to analyze the water? We need to... Paladin? Paladin. Paladin, yeah, yeah. I have some heads I could throw in. <laughs> Somehow I don't think that's that. I don't know. I'm, I'm suspicious of the water. You should It'd be. It would be too easy to get these tokens if it were just water. Maybe we just do a... I don't know. The water lashes out at you. Yeah, it does. Whoa. And misses. Okay. <laughs> I'm staying back from where I'm Unless uh, 14 hits you. No, no, 14 doesn't hit you. Okay. Okay. That was close. I almost got wet. It's a water beer. Some weird water there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Weird or weird? Weird. Weird. It's weird. Mm -hmm. hmm. Roll initiative real quick. Okay. Oh, okay. oh no, we're going to fight the water. <laughs> don't drink the water and don't breathe the air. Okay. Better, better. Hmm. I do love the shield. <laughs> but I get advantage on uh, perception and advantage on. Uh, initiative. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Why? 18. Loose. 15. Sigh. 11. Okay. Gee, that's a switch. Six. Yeah. Well, why is first? Okay. Hmm. Are we attacking the darkness? <coughs> the water? Hmm. Now I'm hearing Dave Matthews in my head. Don't drink the water. Hmm. I don't think of a Tom Lehrer song. Yeah. Um, I'm going to a bonus action, cast Compelled Duel. Okay. Because, you know, I'm a dumb paladin. You You're sure smack are. talking <laughs> the water. <laughs> yes. I don't recall what ch a you know, challenge rating a, a weird, water weird is. But we'll see how this goes. Uh, and he needs to make a do 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 do. Do 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 do. A do 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 do. Wisdom saving throw. DC 13. Okay. It's not high. No, it isn't high enough. It fails. Oh, oh. okay. So now it has to attack me. If it tries to attack anybody else, it would be a disadvantage. But we can't attack yet. Can we, or else right. we, don't we knock it out? If we it? do damage yeah. to it. Oh, well, right now I'm by myself. Yeah, now you have to See what it. I did now? <laughs> yep. Make, okay. Make a nature check. Mm. Uh huh. Oh, that's not great. Yeah, that's only an eight. Hmm. It's water. <laughs> <laughs> it's some weird water. Before you drink from a fountain or a pool, toss a coin into it. It's a small price to pay for your life. Okay. <laughs> I guess that's my action. I'll throw in a gold piece. Gold it's piece? not looking for gold pieces. No. Well, sorry. I don't have any tokens. Well, you... But I'm down a gold piece. Great. <laughs> hmm. So that just kind of my action, like I said? So we're out of tokens. Yeah. Okay. Great. <laughs> you didn't have an odd number of tokens. It is the water weird's turn. Uh -huh. Come at me, bro. Mm -hmm. It misses. Good. Okay. Okay. Be my turn. Mm -hmm. um, yep. I look around the room. What else is in the yeah, room? Yeah, look at, yeah, guys, look around. This might be a while. Uh, oh, I'm looking around the room. Just, uh, just think of 18 plus what? Perception? Yeah. That'd give me uh, 20 something. Anyway, well, what, 20 do, is there anything else around the room besides the water? The, the, <coughs> the, I mean, the pool and the fountain? The pool and the fountain. And, uh, Let's see. Uh, there's you 
there are double doors that lead out into a hallway and a smaller set of doors to the north. Hmm. And the ones we came in were which direction? Those would be from the south. Those would be from south now, yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, so there's nothing else in the room. Um, well, I, if I attack it, though, then it'll... Yeah, just let me deal with it for yeah, now. Yeah, it's not going not gonna to help much. Um. <laughs> I used up a spell slot for this, so might yeah. as well let me do it. Yeah, yeah. Um, let's see. Um, I just run around the fountain mm -hmm. and just check out all the area. And what if he walked? If, he's, if he stood behind the fountain, would he give me an advantage? Yeah, I'll stand behind the fountain. Okay. <laughs> give. It's a ten foot fountain. Okay. Oh, is that? So it's like you really can't stand adjacent or behind it because you'd be too far away from it. Was well, he encompassing the entire fountain though? He's just the front section of the fountain. Oh, okay. You can't literally. Don't worry, why that's right. Why I ask you to yeah. walk into the water, not no, knowing where he is no. in it. So okay. Mm hmm. Well, isn't the water weird? The whole fountain. The whole that's why I try to get at, but no, apparently it's just near the front end. Huh? That's curious. Yeah. Okay. Anyway. And obviously, if I move to one side, he would just move along with me, so yeah, yeah. it wouldn't help. Okay. You can go through another door, I guess. Um. You want to go with me? <laughs> I hate to go alone. As you try to pass by the other door. Yes. With nearby the actual uh, swimming pool itself, a water elemental attacks you. Ah, from where? From the pool. From the pool. Yeah, in order to get by, in order because the pools because there's fountains. Let's draw. So now you have somebody to attack. Picture of this. Yeah, you need to draw a picture of this room. Right, then. Right. So I'm just imagine. If they have plenty of hit points, you might as well. Yeah, it might take yeah, a while. Yeah. Visualizing yeah. a fountain in the middle. Water creatures. Do you have water creatures over there now? I don't have any. Okay. Uh, uh, weird okay. and an elemental. So you have like a you came yeah. through this door. What size is the okay. elemental one? There's a fountain. fountain here. There's a wide pool in the oh, middle. Oh, okay. And a fountain on this end and door over here. That's actually two double doors that are open uh -huh. that lead out to a hallway. And then there's a smaller door to the, to the top. Yep. Okay. So he's over here fighting one. I'm over All here right. oblivious. Someone. And <laughs> you tried to walk past, and a water uh -huh. elemental from the pool. Attacked what size is the water elemental? Okay. Large. Large, okay. <coughs> okay, large elemental. The oh, weird right. is large as well. Oh, okay. Okay. So, uh, let's see. What is my defense? There, I have. Um, it still has the rule to attack. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Does a 17 hit you? A 17, yes, it is me. Okay. Okay, and I can spend a key point for a defense since it is my turn. I, mean, I, got, I can do a dodge. Um, it would be 14 damage, reduced to 7 if you dodge. Dodge is disadvantage. A disadvantage. A disadvantage. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I roll again with disadvantage? Yeah. All right, air ones. Don't have any large water okay. ones. Okay, uh, it's still a 15. I don't miss. Okay. Okay. So one here, okay. one over here. <coughs> ah, ooh, roadkill. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, don't get too close to this pole. So I walk behind the other. I go ahead and, and go behind the other one because I know, since I realize he's he's not going to attack me because he's in influenced to attack. Uh, why? Mm-hmm. Okay. Why not? Indeed. So anyway, so we but, but I forced the one guy to expose himself. You did. Yes. All right. Freezing. Mm. Are you that hungry, Dave? Hmm. Oh. Uh, yeah. A little bit. That's how I got this. Mm-hmm. The callus was like so thick. I yeah. Okay. Anyway, side. I hope this isn't too stupid. But you're shoot I already did something stupid, so go ahead. I'm going to just toss in the pool he's fighting my two-headed poison potion mm. and see if the poison water does anything to the water weir. Mm. It does nothing. Okay. Ah, but he's the affected 50% chance of having two heads. It does nothing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So. Um... 
So you have any other? You have two attacks on you. No, that was considered an attack, though. That was an action nope. to toss that in there. Yep. An action. Full yeah. action, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But it's a top of Y. Okay. I will slash at the. Did you say slash or splash? <laughs> It'll be a splash. <coughs> yeah, it's going to be a 15 plus 7. That hits. A second attack. That's going to be 17. Yep. Okay. Do. That's going to be um, seven magic slashing. Smite him! Uh, six magic slashing. Okay. Uh, sure, I'll throw in one divine smite. <coughs> Do. Oh, one. Gross. <laughs> uh, four uh, radiant. Okay. <sighs> Good thing that was all magical. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. My magic sword. Okay, uh, yeah. That's my turn. Okay. It is the creature's turn. The water reared will obviously attack Y. Sure. Mm -hmm. Does a 16 hit? No. Yeah. That's my base armor, 17. Okay. <laughs> the water elemental what? moves up. He can get out? Yes. <laughs> Now, wait a minute, you said earlier that the pool itself was 10 feet, hmm? right? Yeah. So, if he's, it would be encompassing the entire thing, then. Yeah. He had an advantage. All right, <laughs> all right, all right. I hit him both times. I mean, I can roll yeah. again to see if I roll a critical hit. No. I did not, okay. No. no. <laughs> of course not. Okay. okay. I want a piece of candy. Uh -huh. <laughs> so, first mm -hmm. attack... That's an 18. That don't hit. Okay. This guy's hit hard. 15 bludgeoning. Shoo. Shoo indeed. Second attack is a 26. <laughs> that don't hit. <laughs> Ooh. Another 17 bludgeoning. Damn it, cricket. And I need you to make a strength saving throw. Oops. Not my best. Uh, 15. You oh. just made it. Oh. Okay. <coughs> you would have been engulfed in it, grabbed by it. Uh huh. Grappled. Critters in my pond. Mm hmm. Okay. All right. So that is their turn. Uh -huh. Loose. All right. Now you made me mad. Obviously. <laughs> but you don't rage. <laughs> no, I don't rage. Okay. Nope. Um, all right. So I'm going to use my magic sword. Yes. Wink, wink, nod, nod. Say no more. Say no more. And I'm going to attack the one that attacked me. Okay. Okay. That would be a uh, 17 plus 7. It hits. 24. Okay. And let's see. 6 plus 5. Oh, the uh, 11 damage. Okay. <coughs> okay. Second attack. Another 17 plus 7. Hits. 24. And that'd be 7 damage. Okay. Okay. And I'm going to spend a. I would just use your bonus action with a key point to go dodge. I'm going to, well, dodge, can I uh, do a, a run around, get away from him? I mean, I'd, this would be disengage. Disengage? No. That's still be a key no. point. He struck. I, so okay. as long as he stays next to oh, the yeah, water. Oh, yeah, I the mobility, yeah. Yeah. As long as you stay next to the water weird, you're okay. Well. But you didn't attack the water weird. I didn't attack the one in the pond, the pool. Right. I attacked the one that was... Yes. Was like, so you can yeah. stay within his range and move out of well, here. The water, well, the water but, is compared to only attack against me, so if yeah. it does attack you, he's, it'll be at a disadvantage. Yeah. Well, I don't think he's going to attack me. But anyway, I'm, I'm going to run around. Okay, here. Back to, uh, clear back over to uh, <coughs> Y. Beside me? Okay. okay. Beside Y. That way I can use my protection reaction? Yeah, just okay. in case. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, I guess that's... Uh, I guess that's the end of my turn. I, I didn't have to spend a point of cue to do that. 
No, you only no. have to spend okay. it if you're going to do dodge. All right. Which you got to declare on your turn. All right. Okay. Okay. Uh, sigh. I really don't want to die. <laughs> but I want to be helpful in combat. Mm -hmm. Well, you can hit this one I was tagging. I mean, he's got a little so, damage, whatever that means. I'll use an action to drink my potion of water breathing. Okay. I feel like that might be needed in here, and it works for 24 hours. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And yeah. then... Yeah. That's your action. Yes, I will action surge. Okay. Mm -hmm. To run up to the water elemental. Ah, yeah. Away from him. Yes, the water weird. Yes. Bonus <coughs> action to activate my dagger of venom, because mm -hmm. who knows, it might work. And I will stab at it. You can okay. use... Oh, your exploding uh, arrows doesn't isn't the magic thing. No. Okay. And I, I stab at thee. I think poison might be good. Yeah. It's mm -hmm. liquid in a liquid. Either way, it's still a magic weapon. <laughs> it also doesn't really have any organs to poison them. One T two. Hits. All right. Is it immune to poison? It is. Okay. Yeah, of course. So it's taking at least my damage from the. Hey, it takes seven. Okay. Can you back out? Or is that... Uh, I out? don't. <laughs> <laughs> back to the top of Y. Boy, you guys are really shallow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. Attack him again. Mm. Uh, that's only going to be a... Uh, 11 to hit? Miss. Okay. Second attack... Uh, okay, 18 to hit. Hits. I'll throw in another Divine Smite. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 11 slashing magic. Okay. No, sorry, not 11. 9. My apologies. 9. Oh, good. 8, 7. Okay, so uh, 15 radiant. Okay. <sighs> What, you don't care for my dry humor? <laughs> I'm literally on a website of water puns. <laughs> You're all washed up. That's what they told me. It is the creature's turn. The water weird will attempt to attack Y. It can attempt. And miss. Good. <laughs> the elemental will try to attack Psy. Eep. <laughs> First attack is going to be uh, an 18. Yep. Okay. This guy hurts. <laughs> Takes <laughs> eleven bludgeoning. Oh, you got it off easy. Second attack. It's gonna be only a fourteen. <clears throat> nope. Okay. So you need to make a strength saving throw. You took your water thing. <laughs> <laughs> Seventeen. <coughs> you pass. Mm -hmm. oh. Actually that should be an eighteen. All right, next is loose. Okay, uh, I'm gonna run around, mm -hmm. and I want to run around uh, the other okay. side or oh, side. This side? Yeah. Okay. And attack the one that, that attacked me. Okay. Okay. So I get my attack on both, and you can just get out of there. Attack on Titan. Well, <laughs> of course, granted I'm, that means his could attack. Yeah, him. I'm not gonna. No, I'm not gonna worry about his. Yeah, no worries. Because it's it's a, a disadvantage chance of it hitting me. We don't know what kind of damage it does yet, do we? No, it's not him yet. Yeah. Okay, that would be, um, let's see, uh, 15? That for the... Uh, uh, yes, that hits the elephant. Oh, good. Okay. And 8 damage. Okay. Oh, natural 20. Uh -huh. Double damage? Um, it doesn't have any you know, body parts, really, to... Yeah, so. I, I guess okay. Double maximum damage. Uh, no, you, whatever double. dice you roll, and then add your modifier. No, oh, PT. So what's okay. the dice number? Two. So four plus. Only four plus. How about uh, adding double my? No, the rules are you double what? the dice and then you add the modifier. Well, you don't add them all. No or you can roll two dice. Nine. Come on. Or you can roll another die again. Right, roll yeah. another yeah. dice. <laughs> two. <laughs> See, four. There you go. Plus. It's yeah, destined to be. Here's your <laughs> candy. <laughs> yeah, thank you. It's why Paladin's it going to on 
any crit. Radiant, yes. Uh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Nine Massive damage. Massive dice. Huh? Nine, nine, nine damage. damage. Okay. Well. Mm. Mm-hmm. And then I run away. Okay. Back over to here. Up here. Oh, uh, yeah. Place. Yeah, back there. All right, so Sai. All right, um, I will stab at it. Okay. I forgot to do two attacks last turn on it. Yeah. Oh. Well. Hmm. Uh, twenty-three. It hits. For ten damage. Okay. Second attack. Uh, nineteen hits. For ten damage. Okay. It's bloodied now. <coughs> How does that look? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is that a different shade of water? Yeah, it's kind of mm. like the the water is just kind of flaking off of it and kind of receding back well, dripping the pool, off it. dripping off. Yeah. Hmm. The only thing it has is water, so it just bleeds water. Uh huh. Okay. Alright. We're back up to why? Yep. Why? Hey guys, I thought of a new name for the ship we get, we have. Instead of the Torture Turtle, we could call it Aquasitions Incorporated. <laughs> Cute. Okay, I'm gonna attack now. <laughs> At disadvantage. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's um. Let's see. That's, uh, that's only gonna be us. That's only seventeen. Is that it? All right, second attack. Okay. That's going to be, uh, yeah, 15 plus 7. Yeah, yeah that hits. Alright. Uh, <clears throat> 4 for the first damage. Okay. <laughs> smite? Uh, 9 for this time. I'm not going to throw another smite. I have 3 spells lots left. Oh, so I, mean, I don't okay. want to use them all up in one creature. Yeah. Who knows what's after this, so. Mm. Oh, we're going to take a rest. It'd be, it'd be a long rest for me to get all this back, so. Yeah, well, it has to be a long rest, I'm down to 10 hit points. You can heal off a short. Well, yeah. Okay. <coughs> okay, next is the enemy's turn. Uh, the Water Weird will attempt mm. to attack Y. Does a uh, 17 hit you? No, my shield! No. That's my rolling D, it's a D10. Sorry, it's 18. Now with my shield. <laughs> AC nineteen with my shield. Right, <laughs> right, right. Yeah. Huh. Um, and the water elemental attack Psy. Mm. First attack is a dirty twenty. Yes. <laughs> hmm. You take ten bludgeoning. So anybody in chat? No. No. Second attack. Just showing two there. Just two. Yeah. All right. Is a sixteen. No. Okay. And since you succeeded on the save, you don't need to do it again. So. Yay. Yay yeah, indeed. Uh, my water breathing potion was for nothing. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, once you kill these things, you can go down to the pool and try to collect the tokens. Yeah. Uh -huh. That and, you know, I mean, my, my <coughs> spell compelled duels mostly for nothing. Uh -huh. I could be having you all help me try to kill this thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So my turn. All right. Yes, loose. All right. I'm going to whack at this guy again. Okay. I can run up to him again. Yes. Okay, with my super sword. Yes. Uh, 24 hit? Yes. Okay. And uh, 7 damage. Okay. And 25 hit? Yeah. <laughs> yes. And 8 damage. Okay. And I run away. Should I do punching? Oh, the punching won't hurt. Go, run away. Not yet. Your uh, okay. eventually your punches will count as magical. I think sixth level. Oh yeah. My arrows count as magical at seventh. Yeah. Uh, the book goes to six. Yes. Town yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, goes. Sigh. All right. This guy has got to be the good. dagger. Does a 23 hit? Yes. Okay. Eight damage. Okay. You get two attacks. Second attack. Little 15. Yeah. Um, yes. 15. 15 hits. Nine damage. Okay. 
Okay. That's just easier. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, why? Okay. How's this guy looking? They both look about the same, actually. Oh. It's like you're up the stream without a paddle. <laughs> 16 plus 7. That'll yes. hit. Oh, that's only a nine. No. Okay, only the first hit. Okay. Mm -hmm. Five damage. Okay. <sighs> mm. Are you really looking up as many water jokes as you can? Something that applies. Uh -huh. <clears throat> think I'm pouring it on too thick? I think it's rather weird. Mm. Okay, it's their turn, I guess. Yes, it is. Okay, water mm -hmm. weird against... Why? 21 hits? Yes, it will. Let's see what this thing does. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. 50 D6. Here it comes. <laughs> this is Shadowrun, baby. <laughs> Soak this. But it's only successes, right? It's only uh, successes. Oh, come on. 20 so bludgeoning this? damage. Okay. No, it's not okay. <laughs> and you are grappled. Automatically? Pulled, yes, automatically and pulled five feet toward it. Okay. Automatically, you are pulled into it. Hmm. The river of tears, ah! <laughs> Enjoy the metal armor. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, water elemental will attack Psy. Hmm. That's going to miss. Second attack. Going to miss. Hmm. Yay. Yes. <laughs> All right, loose. All right, I'm gonna run up. It has your buddy. Yes. Yeah, but you know the spell's <laughs> still going. Or wait a minute, I didn't make. Um, oh, a Constitution save. Yeah, it, it's. Saving I forget. Is it, con is it concentration? Yeah, it's concentration. Yeah, concentration. Okay. So. Twenty. Yeah. So well, it's half is ten. ten. Okay, so it's, so ten, it's ten or a ten. Yeah. Oh boy. On a Constitution mm. save. Only a nine. Oh, oh. you, you lose it. concentration. Yeah. Okay, All now right. it can attack everyone. Yes, Indeed. it can. So I'll attack it. Okay. All right. Well, you don't necessarily know that that was the case, though. Well. You just suspect, I suppose. I suspect. Yeah. I suspect your buddy's yeah. in trouble. Because like, I suspected yeah. you had the job done while I was not saying the vows. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see here. Okay, well, uh, 25 hit. Yes. Okay. And let's see. Oh, 16. <laughs> okay. Oh, um, 14. 14 hits. Hits, whoa. Okay. And uh, 9 damage. And. How do you want to do this? Okay. He just. <laughs> <laughs> he releases his grip and it sort of just. Cool. The whole thing just collapses back collapses into the pool, the and <gasps> you see him suddenly trying to breathe again. Okay. I had it going. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You seem to have lost your grip, or you lost your concentration. So was, <laughs> that thing did a lot of damage. I didn't really want it to. Yeah. You know, we had. It's just a drop in the ocean, all right? Uh huh. <sighs> okay. And I'm not a fish out of water. <laughs> okay. Hi. Um, all right. My turn. A 17. Yes. For 7 damage. Okay. A 14. That just hits. All right. For 8 damage. Okay. It's got to be getting close. Yeah. yeah. It's both running dry. You're going to get your head out of, head out of, the, of the water now and, and attack Why? Back to thing. you. Please. Scowl. And then... Scowl. <laughs> <laughs> Trudge through the water. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. yeah. You know, we'll get this one. Half yeah. motion there. 18 plus 7. Hits. Uh, 16? Damage? No. No, 16 to hit? <laughs> yes, it hits. Okay. Yeah. okay. Four. Okay. And uh, seven. How do you want to do this? He's out of his pool, so he must cover the floor. Pretty much, yeah. It's just a big old pile of, of oh, water. Water. Okay. So the ground is uh, difficult, slippery terrain. Ah, oh, slippery terrain. Well, we're not running. Be careful. Yeah, don't run. No. Don't have a little wet floor sign. Yes. 
Cry me a river! <laughs> in the corner of the room, there does happen to be a uh, wet floor sign if you want to oh, put it okay. out. okay. We'll, we'll put it out. <laughs> okay. So, uh, I'm going to go look in the fountain. So I put, I okay. put on my, uh, my manta ray cloak I and have flip up breathing. my hood. <laughs> flip up my hood so I can breathe underwater. Yeah. And then I go into the fountain and, and grab some coins. Okay, we're making investigation checks. Oh. Are there coins in all three of the fountains, or just the middle one? Yes. I got a nine. Yeah, I love the yes. I asked two different questions, and you said yes. <laughs> investigation. There are coins uh, in... Um, all three, or just the middle one? There's a few in this one, but okay. more so in the pool and in this one. Apparently got, more people come through on this end than on that end. I got 15. Okay. 15. Hmm? Okay. Does that mean I get some? Um... I, got, I wanted to get that gold coin he threw in. Yeah, you find that. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay. This should be the signiest. You give that back to me? Yeah, I'll okay, give it back. Thank you. I appreciate that. You also find a um, hundred gold worth of tokens. Okay. And there are five gold each, so 20, 20 tokens. 20 tokens. All right. 20 tokens. Ooh, I can go gambling all the way. <laughs> Maybe not. Or buy a meal. <laughs> so it's fire meal, yeah. That was a nine. I don't think I want to. I mm. saw the kitchen. I don't want to buy yeah, a meal. No, yeah. You find two tokens. Yay. Two tokens. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. okay I'll, I'll look through this one over here then. Okay. Well, could he have had like, an advantage on his because he actually was able to breathe underwater? Yeah, so fine. Was he. <laughs> well, yeah. Okay. But I didn't need it. Well, go ahead and go, go ahead. And roll again. Okay. Then a 19. Okay. Oh, Much easy. better. Yes. Yeah. You find another. I remind you, hey, don't you have water breathing on? Do that again! <laughs> you find another 100 gold worth on 20 okay. tokens. Okay. So. I'll check this one over here. Mm -hmm. The one we didn't fun. clear? Yeah. Uh, I only got five there. One token. Ah, uh, one token. Here, I'll just give it But it, it is you. a super lucky one. I'll give you uh, a super lucky token. Here okay. we go. Okay. Since you spent all your money on the previous ones. Okay. Mm-hmm. Okay, so I got another, essentially, 100 gold. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. No other water weird pops it's out of the other? Nope. Well, that's good. I've got, I need some healing. 27. I take a short rest. And 17. 11. D8 plus 2. Are so you short, short resting, resting in here? Wait a minute. Evidently. Oh, how much you, you're passing out health? No, I was oh. saying how many <laughs> kills we each have. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I could. I do have four greater healing potions. I still have my full <laughs> on hands, which we uh, well, twenty-five. I'll just use my what my. Get I might as well use that on yourself. You took twenty hit points. Well, a short uh, rest in here. A short see. rest, yeah. Mm -hmm. Reasonable. Okay. If we had been sponsored by anyone, you this short rest, rest would have healing. been brought to oh, you by someone. Healing. No. Yes. Oh, okay. Remember that sword? Short rest. Uh -huh. Oh, okay. So that would be. Uh, okay. So I get. Uh, oh, that would be nice. It would be 40. Oh, oh, give me a Alright. Right up. Okay. Okay. Alright. Cheap Christmas candy. Mm. Yes. Okay. I haven't rolled any crits, so, you know. You guys enjoy the candy one. Well, Alright, yeah. so. Crocodile tears. Okay, I'll put away the fish. Well, you'd have been a one. Time. You know, you would have appreciated me rolling one. Yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, I'll put away the water puns now. Unless we create and find some more water creatures. No, please, please. No. Oh, why? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It's, it's weird, though, that we had so many elementals over there, but they're like fire elementals and these water yeah. elementals, or sorry, these air elementals. Yeah, yeah. And there's like a few smaller water ones. Huh. No, no large water ones. Yeah. Since I haven't been using this, and I feel like I need to, mm -hmm. I'm going to use my uh, make a less than 50 gold piece item up here during our short rest. Okay. So I kind of forgot about it. What make a less than fifth one? Once per long rest. Yeah. Once per day. Mm -hmm. I can through the ori make one item of fifty gold pieces appear at my feet. Oh. 
Four is fifty. Four ten minutes. Never. Oh yes, like you borrowed something for ten minutes. Four ten minutes. No. Okay. Oh, you could uh, like. It was ten minutes. If we wanted to trade in the tokens. What? Fifty gold piece bar tokens. (laughs) There's always that. Yeah. Yes, that's not a good way to get casino security after you die. Yeah. Ten minutes later, it disappears. <laughs> <laughs> uh, as long as they can't identify who That's why them. I never yeah. trust that transmitter subclass. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Carve a bunch of wooden coins and give them his silver. Mm-hmm. Sure, yeah. Mm-hmm. He had a lot of silver coins for some reason. Now, normally people would use gold. All right. Mm-hmm. You I like silver. So. All right. I'll keep in mind for ten minutes. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, that, you know, you could just make tokens instead. So the double doors to the west open up to a hallway, Mm -hmm. and there is a single door to the north that is closed. Hmm. Dealer's choice. Uh, Yeah, I'll let you. Uh, Wait, what are the directions again? West or or north? north. West or north. The west Uh, hallway doors are open. They appear to lead... Back to the hallway north. going that down south. Oh. So we want to go north. North. North yeah. again. Okay. We, we need the north by northwest. We After need to find Lottie. Again, we go west. <laughs> Lottie the lizard. Lottie the wizard. Yes. Huh? <laughs> the, wiz- the wizard lizard? The lizard wizard. Huh. We don't need to go there. Ooh, <laughs> that sounds like a character that's not needed but not must be built. Mm. <laughs> the lizard wizard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Who eats gizzard? David Scribe. Anyway. John, I was for our Saturday group. Uh, made a, John made a, a total character as an option for me to play, and I ended up picking him. He has a pet lizard that he rides him out. Eddie Lizard. Eddie Lizard is his uh, name. Yeah. And so one of the characters asking in character, what was the, the, the what was the lizard's name? And I misspoke as Eddie Wizard. <laughs> And I mean, to correct myself was lizard, and they're like Eddie Wizard Lizard. Wow, does he cast spells? Like, no, that was a, that was a, 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 a mis mis misspoke. You know, he's he, he uh, just Eddie Lizard. And so everyone, right, uh, rest of the campaign, eyes oh, Eddie Wizard Lizard now. <laughs> nice. Uh-huh. Unfortunately, I'm playing a gnome in that game, and the lizard, of course, is large size. So I try to pet him, and he just, you know. Bite your hand off. Uh, not no, quite, okay. no. But he did try to smell me with his tongue, so like, okay. Um and he warns me, he eats the small ones, it's like, okay, never mind. <laughs> but at this point now he yeah. just has a speech impediment because I misspoke and it's like he'll just randomly mix up letters. Nice. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. Characters develop like that. <coughs> but being a turtle, obviously he has very high AC, very high wisdom and intelligence and strength, mm-hmm. but he's just kind of Socially like, awkward. Socially awkward. Mm. You know, nerdy kind of explorer. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. The Horizon Walker uh, Ranger. Yes, because it's set in Ravnica. Mm. So he's been many places, but this is the first time he's actually been to Ravnica. And of course, mm. the DM wanting everyone to be part of one of the guilds. He is not part of a guild, so all the guilds are like, join us, join us! Oh boy. Uh-huh. Nice. But one of the uh, guys for one of the clearly evil guilds keeps calling me Turtle Soup. But he's like, come join our guild. You can be Turtle Soup. I'm like, I don't want to be Turtle Soup. <laughs> You're not helping your cause here. No. Yeah. Well, most of the guilds aren't fully evil, but... <clears throat> Chaotic, let's say that. Ractos. Mm. Hmm. Well, Ractos, was one of them. No, it was from uh, Gruul. Oh, okay. They're, they're not too evil. <laughs> they want to destroy civilization. No, but they were impressed with the lizard mount. He's like, you can just ride on walls with that thing? Aww. Yeah. Oh, okay. but I build a, a character. <laughs> it's a gecko. Well, more I like crawl, you know, cl- uh, uh, claws into the walls. Well, yeah, okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right, moving on. So, next room appears to be a large office. Ah. Also beside it are um. Documenter. The changing room stocked with swimsuits sized for every type of humanoid creature. Uh, an investigation check. Yeah, sure. I'll just stand here quietly. Um, Unless no. nobody finds anything. Uh, investigation. I got 12. I guess I'll try. Okay. No, I don't. That's well, nine. Nothing? Five. <coughs> Talk you, man, sir. 
Um, it, it has a documentary roll with advantage because you're trying to figure stuff out. Do documents? Yeah. Oh, well. no. I get candy at least. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you roll with advantage though, so. <laughs> it <even> worse. <laughs> uh, I rolled two and a one. <laughs> oh, you might as well get a piece of candy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, uh, as far as you can tell, so. it's just um, books that she likes to read and financial records. Wait, hold on. So, white chocolate. Maybe. Possibly, I don't know. You can tell that um, several witches have invested in Lottie's business. Oh, how can we tell that? Just various names and oh. occupations and stuff, and it's like these people have been around for a really long time. Uh huh. Do I recognize the lich names? <laughs> well, it's like he's a lich, he's a known lich. I didn't know that one was a lich. It's Catalog of the Lich and Famous. Hmm. Uh, that was the son of a lich. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. For a listen, famous inspiration point. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a good one. <laughs> <laughs> Me making a bad joke on Family RPG, though. I'll go. Uh, no, no. Uh -huh. I'm sorry, everyone. <laughs> Is there anybody else watching yet? No, still no, two people. Still got Should two. we look into okay. the swimming suits? I mean, I don't have any plans on swimming. I didn't plan on getting into the water room. <laughs> Hmm. There's another set of doors to the north. Another set? Boy, this thing Large is clockwork normal. double doors. Clockwork. clockwork. Oh, mm -hmm. no. Can we see through them like a window? No. Can we look through the lock? As you approach, what time is it? As you approach the door, it's nighttime. No. I thought the, the, the clockwork door show a time. No, oh. no, but if you're asking what literal time it is, it is... It is oh, okay, time. yeah. No, I was making a joke about the door. Okay. Be that way. The doors open <laughs> by themselves glare. as you approach. You feel oh. a luxurious room decorated with fine art, rich carpets, several leather couches, and boardroom table. Crystal balls sitting on pedestals around the room flicker and glow, and huge fish tanks swarms with unusual creatures. Some of them are even alive. Nine liches mm -hmm. occupy the room, either lounging around or arguing at the table. All wear leisure suits or sundresses, including one sitting comfortably in the, with a dog in her lap. All appear surprised to see you. I am very uncomfortable now. <laughs> <laughs> I chug a potion. Mm -hmm. Resistance to necrotic damage. <laughs> <laughs> do you have oh! that? Yes, I do. Okay. Oh! <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hi! The one on the couch says, Gods? Who let these rough raff in? The bartender. Yeah, that's right. And one of the other liches motions, Now, Lottie, let them talk. They've got really gone to so many things to see you. <laughs> How did they know if we wanted to see her? I guess that's because it's her place. Okay. Yeah. Um, Somebody else talking yeah, about me. Yeah. You have the um, charisma modifier. We're <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> What do you say? You're the only one with a positive <laughs> Oh, I'm talking to a witch. <laughs> okay. Wheel of Stars. We're looking for the Wheel of Stars. We're looking for the Wheel of Stars. Please. For what exactly? We spoke to your, uh, what were those dragons that were guarding that, uh, uh, guarding that, uh, the, the, the safe area? Did oh, you? yes. I'm quite familiar with it. Yeah, did you uh, did you get any like feedback from those characters? Because they told us where to find or yeah, where to find you. And, I was uh, expecting dwarves. Well, yeah, yeah, uh, he'll tell you about that. <laughs> the wedding didn't go as planned. <laughs> Not from your perspective. As soon as you left their bodies, everything went to normal. Okay. Oh, that's good. Well, that's good for them. Okay, I'm glad I didn't mess anything up for them. They were probably very confused. Mm -hmm. So what do you plan to do with it? What 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 did we plan to do? I, I, <laughs> how, we were just ordered to collect it by Ersons Incorporated. I'm not just going to give it away willingly. Yeah, I, I kinda figured that, sir. Or ma'am. Uh, ma'am. Ah. <laughs> I keep yeah. forgetting it's a female Yeah. Female. Lottie. You my bitch. <laughs> Think of Lottie as Dottie, you know, female. Anyway. Um, Can we buy it for tokens? <laughs> yeah, everybody seems to like tokens around here. What's up? No, dear. You must tell me what you intend to do. Put it in the ori? 
<coughs> and find out what it does. <laughs> <laughs> yes, what does uh, it do? Dear, you're not putting up a very good <coughs> front. Hmm. That's the truth. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. Who have you been fighting this whole time? The, um... Oh, gosh. I can't remember <laughs> those characters. The Six. The Six? The six? The yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. If they were to get their hands on the Ori and all of its components, they would <coughs> destroy the world. Okay. Which is so bad for business. We're here to save the world. Roll Does persuasion check. Okay. Mm. I need your inspiration, please. <laughs> Can I your inspiration, please? You need my inspiration? <laughs> I, thank you. Okay. That was a natural one. <laughs> I don't want the candy that bad. <laughs> 19. Not asking her much. 19. Because that works so well in acquisitions and corporate games. 13. Plus? Plus. 5. 18. Okay. Okay. No, that was intimidation. Crud. I'm not trying to be intimidated. <laughs> <laughs> Sixteen. 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 Do not intimidate the lich board. No. No. <laughs> <sighs> you may use the wheel of stars, but you must stop the six and destroy the Ori when you're done with it. How can that be done? <laughs> You ought to find out now for yourselves. But if you want to, do you, do you know how to destroy it? I mean, we'll do. Well, she created it. She should know how okay. to destroy it. So, okay. But at least we wanted to travel all that way. Uh, we got the teleport. And since now we've been here, we can teleport back here to... Uh, That's worked out so well for you so far. Well, no. I mean, she, he's actually been here. It should be a lot easier. I have a question. Yes, dear. What does the Ori do? No, Many you things. The, you mean the Wheel of Stars? Well, no, the Ori when it's complete. Well, when it's complete. Okay. It's, it's I've never actually put every piece in myself, dear. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> I may have designed it, but I know it's dangerous when it's all together. What did you design it to do? It's... Adapted since I made it. Hmm. Put in things that I did not expect. Which is why I separated all the pieces in the first place. Hmm. Okay. It modified itself? Yes. Is it intelligent? Not that I know of. It's like the TARDIS. But it seems well, the that the, the pieces want to be together. And the longer they are together, the hmm. more power they have. Hmm. Again, all the pieces, as far as I can tell, <coughs> would probably destroy the world. What does the Wheel of Stars What's all there are other alternatives for it to do besides destroying the world? <laughs> Grant unstable power? Hmm. That already is achieved. <laughs> <laughs> uh, how much power you have? <laughs> she hands you the Wheel of Stars. Ooh. Now what Make an arcana check. 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 <laughs> well, at least I get candy. What? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it, it's better for me to have used the uh, the the uh, inspiration for what I did, right? I mean, you're not guilty. Doing bad he about actually it, right? has another inspiration. Oh, you have two inspiration? Yeah. yeah. Do you want to try again with an inspiration? Ugh. No, I really should, mm -hmm. just because. Here, we'll hold that until. Okay. Yeah, uh, it may negate yeah. itself. Hopefully, you don't roll another one. No. That'd be absurd. Mm -hmm. uh, Eleven. Okay. There's two ones. <laughs> <laughs> While attuned to this device, you have a plus one bonus to wisdom saving throws. Hmm. Okay. And you can use an action to cast the Dancing Lights, Guidance, or Message cantrips. So Wheel of Stars, that's what that does? Or? Yes. Okay. Well, there's more. Oh, Dancing Lights. And that's not all. <laughs> guidance. Yep. 
Order now and what get... What was the last one? Message. 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 Oh, I have message. Oh. Okay. There you go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Uh, as a reaction, when a creature you can see within 60 feet of you makes an attack roll, saving throw, or ability check, you make that creature roll a d10 and add or subtract the number rolled. Your choice from the roll. No. <laughs> Once you use this feature of the Wheel of Stars, it cannot be used again until next dawn. Okay. Mm -hmm. 60 feet, ability, attack, or... Is ability, attack, or... Or saving throw. Hmm. Add or subtract the number of your choice from the roll. Hmm. It would be interesting if you <coughs> just had to declare it in advance and only like subtracted or added. Like, you know. Right. Yeah, yeah. Alter gravity. As an action, you can cast fly on yourself or you can cast levitate. Save DC 15. Once you use this feature in the Wheel of Stars, it cannot be used again until the next dawn. Is that once per spell or once total? Uh, fly or? Yeah, or. Okay. Well, once per You can either use fly or levitate. Once. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. That's the Wheel of Stars. Um, okay. Not sure how dangerous this might be. I do have the Mind Flare ahead. Do you know how to speak with dead being a lich? Yes. Would you want this mind player head that worked for the six that might have some answers for you? No. It might have answers for us. If you've encountered anyone from the six so far, they would not have any information beyond goons. A mind player is a goon to them? Yes. Oh my. <laughs> hmm. I took the mind player head back. <laughs> They have things far more powerful to Do you know who runs the six? No idea. Hmm. Well, they're actually just five. <laughs> <laughs> they intend to open a portal to the far realm. Hmm. We've seen one of those. Yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Jimmy Mallor came out of it. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. So there's still the dimensional loop and the chronolometer? Yes. No, we have the we chronolometer. Have the okay. We have the rotor of return and we have the wheel of stars. Mm -hmm. so the dimensional loop. loop, the far gear, and the timepiece of travel. travel. Yep. Don't you have those two? Mm, no. Pretty sure one of the first things you got was the. Then we have something to teleport. The first one was the chronometer, uh -huh. which was the teleport. Oh yeah, mm -hmm. time. Mm -hmm. and then we got the rotor of return, which mm -hmm. gave the set current location and the make an item. Mm -hmm. Now we got the wheel of stars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We did not get the other three. Mm. Did you skip a page? I don't think so. Oh, would it be an appendix? To, uh, well, no, the appendix on? just generally says what they are. I mean, I'm trying to figure out whether... We thought we were going to get some from the Dwarven Vault. That was the Wheel of Stars you were supposed to get. Right. Yeah. Because one came from when we first found the Ori. <clears throat> hmm. We got the Terrarium. One. Yeah, with mm -hmm. the spider there. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. The only other one, but I don't believe we got it, was from the um, opposing corporation with that lizard guy. Mm -hmm. They have one or two of them. From the. Uh, they only have one of them. Hmm. Um, Drum Enterprises, right? Dr Dran Enterprises Dran. has the chronometer and a dimensional loop. Oh. So we did not have the chronometer. We did not get... No. We have the chronometer. We didn't get the dimensional loop. Oh. Okay. Oh, yeah, you found the chronometer in his... Uh, right. Yeah. For that... Hmm. I guess 
he was supposed to offer both of them to you. Oh. Is it saying that now, or you're just thinking that? Um. Well, I just I read the other section because you, uh, look. Yeah, looted the other guy. So yeah, you should have you should have the dimensional loop as well. Oh. What does the dimensional loop do? So we can write that down. Hmm. I'm well, glad you're carrying all this. While attuned to this device, you have a plus one bonus to strength saving throws. Hmm. Okay. And dark vision up to a range of 60 feet. If you already have the dark vision, it increases by 30 feet. Okay. Plus 30 feet's nice. Hmm. As a bonus action, you send your body out of phase with the material world for one minute, granting you advantage on stealth checks made to hide and imposing disadvantage on attack rolls against you. Hmm. Once you use this feature of the dimensional loop, it cannot be used again until the next dawn. We just need the far gear then. Disadvantage. Yes. Far gear mm -hmm. and timepiece, right? We have the timepiece. You said that was the first one we got, right? I was trying to figure out. Yeah, this no, should have been the very first chronometer. thing you found. Okay. Should have been. Okay. Yeah. I got one, two, three, four things. Disadvantage on attacks on me. Anything else on it? Okay. Um, once you use that feature, it can't be used against the next dog. Yep. Uh, choose a space you can see within 60 feet of you. No action required. You treat that space as if it were within five feet of you until the end of your turn. This allows you to move immediately to that space without provoking opportunity attacks or oh, interact oh. with objects or creatures in that space as though they were next to you, including allowing you to make melee attacks into that space. Oh. Once you use this feature as dimensional loop, it cannot be used again until the next dog. Or grabbing an object. Now, okay. Mean, you can use each one of these different effects. Yeah. Yeah. And then... It does a lot of weird things. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Not water weird things, are they? No. No. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. I had enough of that. All right, but I'm looking back over here. It should have been like... I mean, it's not like you use one effect and you can't use the rest of them until next dawn. You can use right. all of them. Some of them have paired options like the fly oh, yeah. or levitate. Yeah. But other than that, yeah. Uh -huh. Watch it be a room we didn't go in or... Somebody we didn't talk to. Yeah. Mm. Okay, which uh, saving throws do you have plus ones on now? Everything but intelligence and charisma. Okay. Mm. It clearly is one for each. Yeah. Hmm. Still nobody else watching? Nope. Two. Oh. Okay. Sad, I know. I mean, relatively speaking, there's probably a few others also streaming that don't also have people watching. Right. And uh, realistically, we, we aren't that consistent enough. Yeah. Now, if somebody was watching they didn't log in, it wouldn't show up, would it? Can they watch without logging in? I'd say, I think you weren't able to really go into Twitch until you logged in, did you? Um, no, I, I could go there. Well, it automatically logged me in. Well, yeah, on this, uh, yeah, right yeah. now, yeah. But, like, before you made an account in the first place. Um, I could go. <laughs> yeah. And I, um, I'm not sure if I can visit. Um, I should be able to see live streaming things. Um, Most people make an account in any yeah. case to, you right. know, to keep track of what they normally watch anyway, so. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Hmm. I was making no mention of you finding it later. It's saying the only thing you need to still find is, is the far gear. You should have. The timepiece to travel is, is the dexterity <coughs> one. Oh. Mm. All right, so I got... That's the one that gives you teleport. Timepiece to travel is the one that gives you teleport. Mm -hmm. Is that... Yeah. What's the chronometer to that? Chronometer... Is time. Uh, intelligence saving throws. Okay, that's what we still need. Yeah, you still need the chronometer. You still need the the, the far gear. Yeah. Hmm. Which, according to the other thing, you should have gotten the chronometer as well. So I guess you said you had it, and I was like, well, maybe I already described hmm. it to you, but what does it do? Have. Okay, chronometer is plus one to intelligence saving throws. You should have gotten both of them from the lizard guy. Okay. Okay. Hmm. 
The first time you attune to the chronolometer, you choose one language you don't know. You subsequently know that language while attuned to the device. Okay. I'll hmm, put a language there. Mm -hmm. At the start of your turn, roll a d6. No action required. On a 1 to 3, you slow down time, gaining an additional action on your turn and doubling your speed until the end of your turn. Whoa. Well, hold on. Slow down time. Mm -hmm. 1 to 3. One action extra. Yes. And double your speed. And four to six? On a four to six, you go forward in time to warn yourself of what is to come. <laughs> okay. The next time you fail a saving throw, attack roll, or ability check, you can re-roll the check and take either result. Would it be you're going back in time? Mm. To warn yeah, you you're about... you're going forward, so you know about something that's going to happen. Mm -hmm. Re-roll a... Saving throw, attack roll, or ability check. Oh, you're looking forward in time yeah, in order to. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. To see, you know. Yeah. Otherwise, once, you, once you use this feature, it cannot be used again until the next dawn. Uh -huh. Also, as a reaction, when a creature you can see within 30 feet of you takes damage, the creature gains an additional action if it is the creature's turn, or can take an action immediately even though it isn't the creature's turn. Once you use that feature, it can't be used again until the next So, time. as a reaction, I can give someone an action if they've taken damage within 30 feet of me. Yes. Hmm. And since all of us had two attacks now yes. during our action. Yes. Yes. All sorts of funkiness. Mm. Oh, I'm going to hold an action then, so you can actually have four attacks. Well, no. No. Well, you say two attacks for an action. Action, but not bonus two actions. actions. Well, yeah. Attack. Extra attack only gives you yeah. an attack, not an action. I thought it said it gave you an extra action. No. The only swap. action surge gives you an extra action. The face swap says additional action if it is your creature's turn. Or take an action immediately, if even if it isn't the creature's yeah, turn. an action, action, not an attack. So a full action. An action. A full right, action. That should be two attacks. With it. Two attacks. Yes. Right. Yeah. So you get, you can get someone, two more attacks. Oh, okay. Because they have two attacks. Yeah. I thought you were referring to getting an action and a bonus action, which no, for you, no. with three blows, would be four attacks. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well. No. Mm -hmm. So we all set. <clears throat> yes. Uh, one more. One more. Far exactly. here. Because you got one more chapter left, so. <laughs> that makes sense then, okay. Mm -hmm. That they had the chronolometer and dimensional loop, and you just got those. Well, you should have gotten those from yes. the Blizzard beforehand, but hmm. I don't know if I just overlooked. Because a lot of the sections, they don't really bold what necessarily should be. You give them this. Yes. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of hard to tell sometimes. You know, so, so. so, what did we think of the name Acquisitions Incorporated for the ship? Well, that, mm -hmm. no, that's okay, okay, but apparently no one else likes it. <laughs> the tortured turtle boat did stay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, unless you can get the other boat. That's true. Yeah, she yeah. ever comes back. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, you can ask her later out of character. That's true. Like, yeah. Hey, yeah. do you like this name? Your vote as a decisionist would outrank theirs. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That also told her, told her whippoorwill and. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But you tell her then also that. It turned out okay for those dwarves. We didn't mess it up for them. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Uh, oh, and Lottie looks like this, by the way. Oh. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yes. A real beauty. She's a lich, yeah. <laughs> Rather good. <coughs> Goody. You know, uh, Ace goes again. <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, and she reiterates, too, that if you don't at least disable mm -hmm. the Ori, uh -huh. if not destroy it, <clears throat> that um, there will be dark destruction in all of you. <laughs> okay. It's like, use, okay. This to dist use this to stop the six from opening the portal, mm -hmm. and don't put all the pieces together. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh -huh. I don't know. The well, other liches do ask about what you do about Actresses Incorporated. Um, they might be talked into franchising or partnerships, but considering you're... Mm. <laughs> even the no. suggestions, like you're dealing with such powerful, evil entities. Uh, maybe. We're always looking for a graveyard shift. <laughs> but um, bum Hmm. So uh, they order one last round of drinks and kick you out once you're done. Well, can we turn in the t 
tokens, though. Yes, you can turn in all the tokens and yeah. get gold back for them. Yay! Because you're not gambling with them further, are you? No. Hmm. And since you didn't do too much damage to her, there or her <coughs> business, mm -hmm. there were other places you could have gone that she would have been less likely to uh, talk to, especially if you just started attacking all the skeletons and stuff. She'd be like, no, no deal. <laughs> you, you've completely well, ruined my establishment. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't do any damage, other than the the water creatures which attacked us. Yeah, that's the only. You know. It's more of a security system to keep people yeah. from nosing. Mm -hmm. Didn't even go through all our books. No. Mm -hmm. Could have been cooking those books. You don't know. Uh, uh, the kitchen. There's nothing good cooking in there. <laughs> no. Congratulations! You're now level six. Oh. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Leaving Lottie's palace behind, you return safely to your borrowed battle balloon. Hmm. Borrowed battle balloon? Yes. Oh my goodness. Ready to figure out in chapter six mm -hmm. where the ritual of the six might occur. Okay. Mm. So since it's nearly eight o'clock, do you want to call it there? Yeah. Okay. And we'll. Uh, uh, next up. Monday, since Matt will be unavailable, we'll probably play something on the Switch mm. or some other uh, role-playing game of some persuasion. Mm. True. There'll be a little bit of a pause on Activision Incorporated while we uh, mm. undergo some changes around a boot. Mm -hmm. Any idea what you guys are doing for level six? Just staying or oh. multi-classing? I'll just, you know, I gotta look see what. Ooh, I get aura of protection. Yeah. <laughs> you don't. Sorry, right, level six. Whenever you or a friendly creature within ten feet of you makes a saving throw, the creature gains a bonus of the saving throw equal to my charisma modifier. Uh, I must be conscious for the to be able to grant the bonus. Wait a minute. Do you, do you get a what? Gives so kind of a. I can get a feat mm -hmm. or a stat, and I don't really need hmm. the stat. Oh, Again, if you want to multi-class into something. Hmm. Yeah, multi-class into any charismas. <laughs> Let's see. D10. Okay, so six. I'm at 57 hit points. Hmm. You have the Paris Handbook on your. I should shelf. have. Uh huh. Yeah, we'll just see. We go with the multi class. Mm -hmm. So is it the Eberron book two. that has the uh, new Unearthed Arcana stuff in it, or? Mm. Um, of which stuff? I oh, know you're using mm -hmm. a lot of the 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 new things <coughs> you gave for my ranger mm -hmm. and other oh, alternate barbarians. Oh no, that should that's still an Unearthed Arcana. Document. Oh, so, so, so PDF. Yeah. Get the highest I thought some of that stuff had been printed. A couple of things have been. No, no, no. Uh, like some uh, of the races. With your strength. And some of the other ra uh, class mm -hmm. things have been put yeah. into the uh, Xanathars. Okay. Uh -huh. Well. Yeah. Nothing that's going to get you right. really high. Spells are still yeah. the same. Yeah. Hmm. Don't give me an extra skill. Do you have the Eberron book handy? Eberron is probably in the far end. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you want to go? I'll click it. it or, uh, do you want me to stop the stream? Because we're not so. Uh, sure, if you want. Okay. Uh, yeah. Until next time, happy gaming. Bye-bye.